And now in other news, as Israel is fighting a multi-front war for its very survival, unity among the Jewish people is more crucial today than ever. Unfortunately, in Israeli society, deep divides still remain even between secular and religious Jewish Israelis. Joining me in the studio today is Reb Adam Yitzchak and Rabbi Abraham Mordechai Gottlieb, whose life's mission is teaching the Kabbalah and spreading a message of unity, a message for which he's paid a heavy price. His Bet Midrash, a rabbinical school, was recently destroyed, and he was pushed out by his community. But he's not letting this stop him from spreading his important message, and today seeks to rebuild his school to spread this message among the younger generation. And if you want to help, you can scan the QR code on the screen now. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you. So, Rabbi, you're an expert on Kabbalah. You've written numerous books on the subject. You know, before we start, for those who may not be familiar, can you tell us briefly what exactly this is? What exactly is the Kabbalah? The Kabbalah is uh, the spiritual levels of every person. It's going from up, from the God himself, and down and down till our world. And um, the Kabbalah said that all the levels is according to loving each other or hating. If you are hate, you are very, very down, in a down level. And if you, you can love um, every, everyone, so you, you are in a highest level. Mm -hmm. That's the Kabbalah. And, you know, you speak a lot about the importance of unity, as you mentioned, the importance of love. Uh, and you try to also discuss, you know, problems uh, within the ultra-Orthodox community and Israeli society. Uh, this seems to have upset the religious establishment. I mean, why do you think that is? I'm coming from the religious world, and um, there is no learning of spiritual in, uh, in the yeshivot, not uh, for um, boys and not for girls. And that make the, the religious very, very dry. And the religious, the religious is from outside and not from inside. It's not built very, very deep emotions for everyone. There is no love, there is no, uh, the, um, the connection between people is not so deep. Everything is more from outside, not from inside. And that's make very, very uh, big arguments between all the parts and the, um, of the Judaism. And Rabbi Yitzchak, is there anything you would like to add to that as well? Certainly. I think that for a long time now, we've attempted as a community to rebuild Torah and try to connect to tradition but there's a very important, arguably the most important aspect of the tradition, the inner part of the tradition that is large in part missing. So we're very inspired to try to balance the system and speak on this necessary learning of love and coming to altruism. I think that um, the, main, the main thing that there is war with us and the anti-Semitism um, became more and more biggest is because the situation between the Jews is very hard. There is a lot of arguments and a lot of wars between the Jews. And I think the, the main thing today is make first of all peace between all the parts of the Judaism. And I think the Kabbalah make it. From the Kabbalah. And I want to talk a little bit about uh, your Bet Midrash that was uh, recently destroyed. You're seeking now to rebuild. Yes. What do you need to accomplish this? And, and what's your vision for uh, the new Bet Midrash? Um, I want that the Bet Midrash will be general of everyone. And um, I have between my uh, pupil um, not religious, and I have, uh, for example, gays, and I have orthodox, and I have from all the kinds. 
I think the woman, the woman is very, very strong in spiritual. Every Shabbos I have a very beautiful lesson. Four o'clock before the morning, sit already a lot of women and learning seriously. And I think the, the women can be leaders in spiritual in, in Israel, in all the world. Well, Rabbi and Reb, thank you so much for joining us today and for this very important message. And to our viewers, if you would like to help rebuild the Beit HaMidrash and help the rabbi spread this message of unity within Israel, scan the QR code on the screen now.